Hummel introduces its new range of cable glands for hazardous areas. Tested and certified according to the latest IECX and ATEX standards. This video demonstrates the fast and safe installation of the Exios EXD cable glands. With only 9 sizes of entry threads from metric M16 to M75 and NPT 3 8 of an inch to 3 inches, the Exios gives you the full range of cable sizes used within cable installations. The first step is to disassemble the gland. The two main parts are the entry component with its captive armor cone and the gland body. The Exios come with two low profile clamping rings to fit most common sizes of cable armors. The next step is to install the entry component. Our metric threads come with a silicon o-ring as standard. The entry component is also fitted with a silicon o-ring to prevent water ingress into the gland, often referred to as a deluge seal. Now the gland body can be slipped over the cable. The cable should then be prepared according to the written installation instructions. When the preparation of the cable is finished, the armor size can be identified. Select the appropriate armor clamping ring to fit the size of the armor. The armor clamping ring can then be slipped over the cable. The orientation is clearly marked on the ring and can be inspected at any time. The next step is to prepare the armour to fit it on the armour cone. Now insert the cable and bring the armour and the interlocking armour cone together. Ensure that the armour is sitting completely on the armour cone. The gland body can then be tightened easily by hand to assure the armour clamping. To check that the armour is successfully clamped, Release the gland body and inspect the correct fitting of the armour. For the final tightening of the gland body, we recommend the torque value specified in the written installation manual. Now tighten the dome nut to finish the installation. The Exios gland installation is now complete.